Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Roots of Knowledge presents a course on Aqidah, on beliefs called elements of faith, the fundamentals of Aqidah. And Aqidah beliefs are things that are very important for me and you as Muslims. It shapes the way we think, it makes us understand and makes us believe the way that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants us to believe. And this course is going to be based upon verses from the Quran which we read day in and day out possibly you know many of these verses like Ayatul Kursi how many of us read this however are unaware of the lessons of Aqidah that these verses have inside of them you know this is just one of the verses you have Surah Al-Ikhlas verses that are filled with Aqidah lessons for us regarding how we should perceive Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his attributes and these were the same verses that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam recited to the companions of the Sahaba radiallahu ta'ala anhum and propagated to them and the Sahaba radiallahu anhum remember were in a society a paganistic society a society that was filled with shirk you know they say that the Kaaba was the place that was filled with idols over 360 idols were worshipped in Mecca at that time and when the Prophet ﷺ began to recite verses of Tawheed of monotheism of oneness of Allah this brought a revolution in the society and they started to think the way Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wanted them to think and the Kaaba became a center of Tawheed of the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and so those same people who were you know prostrating to, to idols became people who were prostrating and supplicating to the one Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and this began to spread across the world so the elements of faith my brothers and sisters is a course for me and it's a course for you where you'll be learning about verses of the Quran regarding Aqidah regarding Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala his attributes his qualities his names you'll be covering about angels the angels of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Jibreel alayhi salam, and many other duties that the Quran mentions about the angels. You'll also be learning about divine books, scriptures that Allah revealed upon the noble prophets. And more specifically, you'll be learning in detail about the Quran. You'll also be learning about prophets of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. How many prophets were sent down? You know, who were the prophets of Allah? You know, what was the status of the prophets? Who were they sent to? These is something that you'll be covering as well. You'll also be covering about the day of judgment. You know, the day that all of us will have to face. What does the Quran say about this day? When is it coming? What are the signs? What's going to happen on that day? What's going to happen after that day? These and much more will also be mentioned. And finally, you'll also be covering the divine decree, the taqdeer, the qadr. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has written and ordained for us you know what does this mean are we free do we have will these are things that I'll be discussing in the course inshallah with verses of the Quran supporting if you're interested in this course it's gonna be a 12 week course over 12 weeks or online and details of the course will can be found in the description below inshallah and if you're in, interested and you want to learn more about it inshallah you can email and there should be an email in the description below as well jazakumullah khair assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh